Welcome back to the show. Vince Copeland's with me now, and he is a new Delawarean. And um, we're going to find out where are you from, Vince? I'm from Michigan. From Michigan. And I want to tell everybody, I knew nothing about Vince, okay? Like last week even. But I Googled your name, right? Oh. And everybody, that's nothing bad, okay? If you don't know what Googling someone is, it's nothing naughty. <laughs> I just typed his name into the computer, did a little search, and I found um, an article about you on the USTA website. So that was cool beans. Yeah. So I do know that you lived with three women in Michigan, is that right? That's correct, <laughs> yes. So who were those three women? That's my wife, Terry, my daughter, Nicole, and my other daughter, Danielle. Okay. I'm wondering, did you come to Delaware just because you probably could win no fights at all in this household? Oh, I know that. <laughs> I have no, no future. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, to forget about it. Three women against one man, you know, it's it, don't even try to argue with us, right? No, not at all. <laughs> now, tell me about your daughters. Uh, my oldest daughter, Nicole, just started college. She wants to be a teacher. And my youngest daughter is another, two more years of high school left, and she's on the equestrian team. And she just won um, most valuable person on the team. And she's on the, uh, and this is her second year on the varsity too. And she was the high point leader on the team too. Oh, cool. So you got another equestrian then. Oh yeah, she's really big in the horses. I have one bookworm that loves kids. And I have another one that doesn't have much patience for kids that loves horses. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. They say if you have two girls, they're completely opposite from one another. True. Okay. True. Mommy, you know that, don't you? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> So Michigan is like the um, the cutout of like a mitten, right? That's yes. the mitten state. Yes. For a good reason. It's very cold there. Yes, you know? really cold. <laughs> really cold. It's a little bit cold today while we're doing this interview, but I was looking up Michigan temperatures. It says for November, normal high is mid 40s and normal low is low 30s. That's about right. It's about right. Yeah. Okay. Maybe if you're lucky. If you get unlucky, it gets cold. <laughs> So you must like the weather here a little bit better anyway. Yes, so okay. we've had quite a bit of rain lately that is unusual from what I hear, but mm -hmm. uh, it's been a lot warmer here than Michigan. Well, tell me about some other things about Delaware that you like. I like the racing, the money, the people have been really nice. Um, I kind of like everything. I, I really have no complaints, you know. I mean, everybody has been super nice and uh, you know, it's just, it's different. You miss your family, you know? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, actually, speaking about family, you do have a family member here, though, right? Yes, my dad's here. So, we uh, that's really good. That's good, because I missed him when we, I was away from him. Aww. Now, I thought that it was really important that Vince knew a little bit about Delaware. Earlier, before the camera started rolling, I actually gave him a history about Caesar Rodney. If y'all don't know who Caesar Rodney is, go to the library. Yeah. <laughs> Very interesting story, yes. right? Yes, yes, it was. All right. Well, one of the things that you should know about Delaware is we were the first state to have a beauty contest. Yeah, oh. All right, there you go, 1880. And one of the judges was Thomas Edison. So I so, thought that was kind of cool. Now, of course, you know that um, we became the first state in the union. I mean, yes. that's why everybody knows us as the first state. We're also known as the diamond state. It was Thomas Jefferson who, of course, wrote the Constitution in the first place. He said that Delaware is like a diamond, small but very valuable. So that's why we're known as the uh, diamond okay. state. All okay. Right. See, he's really taking all this yep. in because he's uh, going to amaze everybody next time he goes to the track. Yeah. Um, and I think just the last thing I want to tell you is that did you know that Sussex County, because we have three counties in Delaware, raises more broiler chickens than any other county in the United States? No, I did not know that. Didn't know that, no. see? Mm -hmm. That's new. That's <laughs> interesting. <laughs> All the things you can learn on post time. I bet you did know that we have a tax-free shopping. Yes, yes. yes. That right. and a lot of police officers. <laughs> <laughs> Well, all right then. Those are two of the most important things that you should know. Yes. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> That's very funny. Oh, gosh. I wanted to give Vince a quick quiz about uh, Michigan. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. These are kind of hard, but I thought they were really interesting um, for people that like geography and things like that, like people like me. Okay. Michigan is home to more blanks <laughs> than any other state. And it, you wouldn't, it's a place that's has to do with a sporting event, but people do it singly. Like you could go by yourself to this place and knock a ball around. Golfers. 
There you go. Yeah. They have more public golf courses. Oh, I yeah. gave a lot of hints there, but yeah. okay. <laughs> Michigan ranks first in the nation in the number of registered blanks. Okay. The it's a vehicle that you ride. Oh, snowmobiles? Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, a lot of snow in Michigan. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, great, man. See, you were very impressive. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. When I told Vince before the interview that I was going to be giving him a quiz, yeah, he was a little unsure about that. But, yeah. uh, you know, yeah, he decided to let me interview him anyway. They weren't too hard. They, they weren't too hard yeah. there. All I right. I appreciate it. <laughs> well, thank you for being on the show. Okay. And um, actually, we're going to get ready to watch a race. It's not one of your horses that you train because you have seven right now, right? Yes. Okay. All right. Gosh, we didn't even mention any of the horses in the no. barn. Let's do that real quickly before I let him go. Okay. Who's your favorite horse? Itchy's my favorite one. Okay, tell me about Itchy. Uh, we raised him, and I've had him he's six, so we've had him, you know, since he's a baby, since we raised him, and he's been with me ever since, and I don't think anybody else has driven him either, so me and him kind of, you know, buddies, I guess. All right, all right, and he's racing at Dover, right? Yes. Okay, all right, mm -hmm. we'll watch for him at Dover. Uh, but this race, I got you in the winter circle with staying power, one of okay. your catch drives. Yep. So, all right, thanks, Vince. All right, thank you.